Lake. Przybyliśmy tutaj na wielkie targi zegarków i biżuterii. Można tutaj dostać oczy plan, słuchaj, tylko od tych elementów, które zdobią nasze nadgarstki. Ilość firm, która jest tutaj prezentowana jest gigantyczna, połowę z nich w ogóle wcześniej nie, nie znałem. To co jednak najistotniejsze to sposób prezentacji tego wszystkiego. Każda z firm zdaje się realizować maksymę postaw się, a zastaw się. To jest proszę Państwa lotnisko Breitlinga. Tutaj wszyscy klienci lądują. This was the future, but the future is now. Okay. This is our expo space. It was our, let's say, uh, the top item last year. And now we set it and we can deliver it. Okay. So it was the proposal for la last year? Exactly. Okay. Okay. But still it's good. So yeah. Now you're using completely new materials, as I know. Uh, 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 this is a uh, cold. This is uh, one of the lines. Yeah. This is our... Uh, The entrance in the world of Freitling, the port products, automatic watch movement and also sure chronograph, very robust and uh, very nice design, very strong design. So we have different lines and in these lines we play okay. the styles with function and with uh, scraps. And this is super Porsche. Yeah. So Porsche is the collection for diving. I'm not sure about it, but... I survived. I believe you've got quite busy time here because many clients uh, is coming here to to take the knowledge about your beautiful watches. Yeah, that's pretty true, and uh, it's good because if you are not very busy during Basel first, especially your first day, you may be in trouble. So it's good to be very busy. So this is the the, the big hope for the good business after after. Yeah, the first of course. Day. But you've got them amazing products, I believe. So. Uh, It shouldn't be any problem with the client. <laughs> no, for sure we try to do our best to uh, improve every year uh, our new product. And for this year, Breitling uh, Basel, for Basel World 2016 is really concentrating. The highlights is on new materials. Okay, to tell us about it, please. So, uh, new materials for us is uh, <clears throat> it's, uh, in a kind of uh, tradition at Breitling to innovate. For us, innovation is really something we did from the very beginning at Breitling, and that's why we also continue to do that. And this year, we um, are coming out with very new material for both the aesthetic, uh, for both the uh, resistance, as well for the performance of the movements. First, we have a, a special uh, movement developed by our special uh, <coughs> research and de development lab, R&D, called ChronoWorks. When we try to put all what we could to improve the efficiency of our um, in-house writing B01 caliber, I don't want to go too much in technical details. Yeah. But this is a secret, probably. Uh, no, yeah. How, how we achieve that? It's a little bit of a secret, okay. of course. But uh, we try to reduce as much as possible the friction, to improve the efficiency, to uh, to lower. Uh, the, the, the energy which is needed to have this, uh, the, the movement functioning and what we achieve with this uh, improvement is we had you know, 45% in terms of uh, uh, power reserves so we had already with the Calibre Brighting Visa 1 a good power reserve of 70 hours but having improved that by 45% we have now a 100 hours uh, power reserve which means more reliability and also more precision That's regarding the Chrono Works, which is presented this year in a ceramic case uh, <coughs> model called Super Ocean Heritage Chrono Works. Then we have uh, another very new uh, features in terms of we are no more on the movement side, but we are on the case side, on the outside. We have a, a big watches, 50 millimeters uh, in diameter, and even it's big, it's very light because the material is a unique, uh, <coughs> exclusive material which is presented this year by Brightling, it's called Bright Light. It's a composite polymer which is 3.8 lighter than titanium, which is already light, and 5.8 lighter than steel. And you cannot believe it, but this 50mm watts seems big, seems heavy, but it's just 69 grams. I don't know what I can touch without the, the hand, <coughs> hand shoes. Yeah, you can. <laughs> okay, so it, it will be more professional. Why are you using this? Just to take care about the watch, to not touch, to not scratch it? No, I think it's uh, it's both... Uh, as you know, our slogan, Breitling, is Instruments for Professionals. And in the meaning of Instruments for Professionals is, of course, uh, 
strong precision uh, functionality, but also uh, strong design. And that's also, it's not only very resistant, it's scratch resistant, very hard, but also you can see the feeling of the material here. It's very warm. The marble effect you have with this composite polymer material is quite nice, as well as uh, oh, we talk about aesthetic. So again, it's both having the optimum between functionality and aesthetic. That's typical brand. And I was asking also why are you using this? Gloves? Yeah, just to take care about uh, the stuff, to present it in the lab. Yeah, I think it's... Uh, elegant. Of it's elegant, it's a luxury product, and of course it's very scratch resistant, but you know, to keep the, the crystal uh, clean and so forth, that's why we are using gloves to present the products. And the last one? The last one, this is uh, again an, a new material for brightening, which is used is uh, in the um, brightening for Bentley line. This is a Brightling for Bentley GMT B04S with a carbon fiber uh, <coughs> case. So it's completely machined. It's a big piece of uh, it's a piece of um, carbon fiber, and then everything is machined to achieve these nice shapes. Okay. And you see also the aesthetic. You can see the machining, and you can <coughs> it gives a very very uh, nice uh, look. Modern, uh, and yeah, modern, yeah. yeah. And uh, if you could tell me, is there any better place than Basel to present the new, new watches and to present the company, to present the brand? Is there a for us? Really, Basel is a place to be. Uh, this is a kind of uh, tempo or rhythmus we have. Yeah. Every year we present our new models here in Basel. So it's really the. the well, we have everybody here, and the people we are interesting to, uh, the jewelers, the distributors, uh, affiliate wanted to, to order new models, they have to come to Basel. Ten That's days of really, yeah, ten, ten days, days of very heavy yeah. work. Uh, exactly. It is amazing that you create such a big space, big areas for for a touch, and just just like the big office and shop in one in the middle of something what before was completely empty. Yeah. So yeah, this is like but this is exactly uh, why Bright, uh, Basel is so important for Breitling because we really want it to be here and very strong. So we concentrate all the effort, all the communication, all the investment we do for presenting the new product. It's really Basel world. We don't do pre-Basel or launch in, uh, in, in September. This is not the Breitling way. Really, uh, all our efforts in terms of presenting new product is done here at Basel World. One of your partners is the Polish company called Abart. Probably you know it. Mm -hmm. uh, the Polish market, market starts to be important for you, or this is the beginning of the cooperation? No, I think everybody is important today because you know the the world is uh, is global. It's mm -hmm. flat. Everything is going very fast. So uh, Poland, of course, is not. The, a big market like our biggest market, but it's a very important market for sure. Thank you very much for your time. As I know you are busy a lot, so this 10 minutes you dedicate to us, is, we appreciate it. Thank you very much, Olivier. Thank you. It's always a pleasure to meet you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.